Nugadu is about an immersion program to revitalize the language. We have at present about 75 children attending our school, um, and starting with infants, six weeks old, all the way to, we'll be opening up third grade this coming fall, and uh, we're looking forward to it. Um, but our whole concept is that the child is immersed in the language from the time they walk in until they walk out of the school system. The Preservation Foundation has always been very helpful to our Nugadua school um, in that um, they've offered many, many grants to us, ranging from um, hosting workshops, training, to the position that I started in two, three years ago. Probably the, the couple of areas that we are really struggling with or challenged by is um, books. We don't, um, we don't have a library where we can go and check out Cherokee language books. Everything, everything that's written uh, in the syllabary, we have to write, we have to translate, we have to develop. Or, um, and you know, we've gotten several thousands of dollars to, to do in published books. Um, in addition, the, you know, we have gotten funding for translators who come in and help us, and these are people who are elderly but strong in the language, and uh, we're, we're constantly uh, writing books and developing um, materials for children to use in the classroom. They're always helpful, and they're always uh, sending us information like, um, you know, you might have an interest in applying for these funds, um, or they might just send us information about, you know, this is something that's going on. Is that something you guys are interested in? Their, their wealth of information, and in addition to funding, um, they're always looking at our, our projects and saying, is it going well? Is there anything we can do to um, keep you on task, to help you make, to be successful? Uh, what we're doing is we're developing uh, and teaching second language learners to be teachers. Um, we have, I think, five second language learners in the program who are teachers and doing an excellent job. We, um, we have interns coming in, they're saying, I want to learn the language, and they're also being immersed, and that is absolutely the best way to learn the language is to be immersed all day long. And um, so what we're looking at in the next 12 years what I see happening when we have these kids that are coming up in third grade, when they graduate, I truly see some of those kids being able to do, uh, what do you call it, um, graduation speech in the language. <laughs> Not only that, but um, we have had, um, I think it was a year ago, we had a kindergarten and a first grader present a resolution to tribal council, and it was in the syllabary, and they read it, and, and made a presentation totally in the language. This organization is all about language, and it's all about the Cherokee language. And we've been in operation for almost nine years now, or just a tad over nine years. And um, our mission is to revitalize the Cherokee language.